Welcome to week three of the CGS 2008 North America Training Camp. Y'all ready for this? This is DJ Wheat, lead sportscaster for the Championship Gaming Series, and week three of the 2008 CGS Training Camp is officially done. Over the past few weeks, results have been mixed, and the racing has been incredibly aggressive. Tonight, we'll find out how each of the six teams will perform on one of the most takeout friendly maps the racers will see all season long. Tonight's Forza 2 competitors will be racing on the Forza course Diamondback, which has the most turns out of all of the CGS tracks this season. These racers will face 13 different turns in this three lap race, and each turn will open a new takeout opportunity in this 1.4 mile track. Gentlemen, start your engines. Carolina's General E Live and Phantom versus Chicago's Chomper and Jason X. The rivalry between these two teams continues. Carolina's General E Live and Phantom are up against Chicago's Chomper and Jason X. Last year, Chicago's team dominated the races in Project Gotham Racing 3, but now that we've switched to Forza, things aren't quite the same. This race started in your typical fashion, start, bash, go. As all the drivers collided on the first turn, many were spun, some stopped, but course Phantom, he got dragged. And fortunately for him, he was dragged into position that worked in his favor. As Coors Phantom recovered, his teammate General Elive had broken away and was cruising towards victory, while Chimera's races were struggling to find their bearings. This is the second time in the training camp that Phantom has played roadblock to ensure victory for his team. As Phantom raced away, Jason X nailed Chomper as he was hitting the wall. The rest of the race was smooth driving and allowed Core to win 6-1, taking first and second place. Last year's champs, Jason X and Chomper, are still winless in the training camp. Round two, New York's Comeback Dan and Darkstorm versus Dallas's Muffin Man and Chaos. In a unique strategy right out of the gates, New York's Darkstorm decided to break his competition by slamming on his brakes, causing a very nice Dallas Venom crash. This impact of the maneuver sent Darkstorm flying into the other Dallas racer to give Comeback Dan a big first place lead. This smart move by 3D allowed them to jump into first place, but the race was far from over. At the end of the first lap, it was New York's Comeback Dan in first, Dallas Muffin Man in second, Chaos in third, and New York's Darkstorm in last. In the second lap, an opportunity arose for Dallas to grab first place. If the team played their cards right, Chaos could take out Comeback Dan and allow Venom Muffin Man to accelerate into first place. Comeback Dan had other ideas. As he approached the seventh turn on the track, Comeback Dan actually faked the turn, causing Chaos to fly past him and connect with just the wall. As the two tailing racers took the turn, they too attempted a crash, and it worked in Venom's favor. As racers recovered, Darkstorm was in the lead, but he was driving in reverse. As he corrected his vehicle, both Dallas racers sped past him, putting him in fourth place. 3D New York won 4-3 with Comeback Dan at the front of the pack. Round three, San Fran's Sacramanjaro and mix em up versus LA's GTO and Chavasong. The opening seconds of this race reminded me a little bit of synchronized swimming, only without the water or without the cars. Both teams perfectly swerved into one another in a crash that almost seemed premeditated prior to the match. Both teams recovered nicely with optics out front, but in the first turn, GTO broke inside, almost taking out both San Francisco racers. While he did manage to take out one of the LA drivers, Chavasan was still neck and neck with a first place optic racer. In the second lap, Complexity Chavasan had the opportunity to strike at the optics front runner. And this perfect impact allowed him to take first place away and hold on to it until the finish line. Although his LA counterpart was in last place, this move allowed LA to take first place, which awarded them a four to three win in the match. Optics mix em up took second, and Sacamonjaro took third. Make sure to check out more full-length matches from the Championship Gaming Series 2008 North America Training Camp 